looking towards incentives to get people in, into Main Street and get some of these downtown spaces uh, open. So thank you everyone who worked on this project, who persevered. I want you to remember, 13 years, that's how long it takes to get something real worth it. And the, and the wait was worth it. People are going to complain, but you have to put your head into the wind and move forward regardless. Thank you. God bless you. Love you. This almost $16 million infrastructure project will help energy energize the historic district and encourage locals and visitors to spend more time shopping, dining, and exploring the unique historic buildings throughout, some of which include Fort Christian, Emancipation Garden, the synagogue, Reformed Church, Market Square, Pizarro Home, and the Enid Bar Library, to name a few. As we continue to build back the Virgin Islanders, the Virgin Islands, for Virgin Islanders first, by way of extension, we are building an infrastructure that is also attractive to visitors. So I will say to the contractors and to the men and women of the Department of Public Works, thank you. Thank you for steering the course. We know that this was not an easy project as um, shared with us today by many, but it's done. But it's, this project is done. But well, we have so, so much work to do to rebuild this territory. And I'm certain that all of us that are here today, we are up to the task. So projects like these are very important, right? Because we're highlighting not only our history, our culture, but we're also beautifying the area. So this has been going on for decades. I would probably say hundreds of years. There's been several iterations of Main Street being revitalized. So this is just the most recent one. And of course, we do it first for our local Virgin Islanders, and then our, our visitors get a chance to take advantage as well. Of course, um, we're really excited about this. We can expect several more projects like this to be coming up. Um, of course, we just, uh, we're about to wrap up phase one of our Veterans Drive project. So we're really excited to have um, downtown Charlotte and Mali have the facelift that it deserves. When phase two comes along, of course, that'll be Putting these things just into perspective for people, you'll have a historic stroll, highlighting our culture, highlighting the importance of Charlotte, the beautiful Charlotte Mali Harbor. So we're just excited for um, what our visitors are going to experience for years to come.